crucial pieces. and welcome to the Booster Gold Exploration Adventure Series. This adventure will take you to the Chinatown district of Metropolis. I'm Booster Gold. Initiate field report. A representation of the diversity in Metropolis, Mannheim's Chinese theater is a beloved part of the city and home to rich cultural offerings from gallery exhibitions of cultural beauty to dramatic performances of modern theatrical masterpieces. The theater itself is a dark cavernous room with large plush seats and the faint scent of magical mayhem. Double, double, toil and trouble. Abracadabra will burst your bubble. Originally a technological Khan artist from the future, he betrayed his fellow rogues in an effort to gain actual magical powers from the demon Neron. I'm Jack Ryder, and you are wrong if you think you're immune to sorcerers like Felix Faust. He's thousands of years old, and he sold his soul. This is Madame Xanadu's Occult Curiosities, a magic shop where you may enter freely, unafraid. Ancient secrets lie behind each of the rune-covered books that line the store shelves. Well, that's what they claim anyway. I, Booster Gold, just wanted to purchase a magician's hat. It must have been out of stock.
The Shen Li Po Gardens of Chinatown are known for their exotic beauty and scenic seaside view. I, Booster Gold, find gardens are great for sitting in while waiting for someone to ask you for your autograph. I usually bring an entire box of pens because you can't be too prepared. This is Booster Gold again. I hope you enjoyed your visit to Chinatown. I've always believed that it is the heart of magic in the city. Yep, there you go. Now that you have a theme for your base, you need to get a deed. These are used to actually grant base ownership and to select a location for the entrance. Congratulations. You are now a bona fide bad guy with a base. Head there now, and we can take a little tour. Congratulations. You are now a bona fide bad guy. This is your mainframe, the nerve center of your lair. You can use it to gain access to powerful tools like orbital strikes, henchmen, and powerful equipment mods. Your mainframe's power is maintained here as well, so be sure to keep it up so you can access the more powerful features. This is your dispenser, where you'll pick up the items that you've chosen in the mainframe, such as communicators for your henchmen and orbital strikes. Finally, this is your base's control panel. It's used to enter decoration mode, alter some of the colors of your base, and for other diabolical purposes. That's just the beginning of owning and operating your evil base. So, why don't we try placing some base items? I've given you a few things. Check your inventory and collect the base items. Now that you've added the base items to your base inventory, use the control panel to enter decorator mode. While in decorator mode, you can place your items at the appropriate markers. While most base items are just for show, there are amenities you can acquire that have very specific functions like bank, mail, and broker access. However, amenities can only be placed at specific markers. Once you have filled up enough markers, you will unlock free placement mode and be able to place base items almost anywhere. That's the gist of it. I'm sure you'll figure out even more tricks to your base. Have fun decorating. Remember, make it evil. And don't forget to try placing those items. I am delighted with you. I am delighted with you. Trigon's energy is free to enter into this plane through his daughter, the so-called hero, Raven. Ha! <laughs> Trigonic energy is corrupting human souls across the Tomorrow District. Join the demon rampage and show these ridiculous science police what magic can be.
Chief Researchers Journal, this heart is a telltale example of our profound work. Blood Priest Chronicle. This gem manipulates the very air around it, as though it were made of solid acid. Trigon's evil energy is manifesting in dark orbs. Bring these to the circle of corruption cast by Trigon's demons. Blood Priest Chronicle. This once weak healing scroll has been infused with the power of lust by one of Trigon's Hey man, sons. grab me some science please. Trigon's evil energy is manifesting in dark orbs. Bring these to the circle of corruption cast by Trigon's demons and add to his might. Have a 
survive one. Metropolis formed the science police as their own superpowered force, including magic. Kinda cute that they think they can take out Trigon. Or you. Still, these science police struggle? Trigon's corruption spreads with each psychic vortex. Punish the police for daring to interfere and use the Eye of Sin to corrupt humans into demons for Trigon. demon for you. Trigon holds Raven thrall to his dark will inside the science police headquarters. Soon, she will become his portal into this world, and his evil energy will be ours. Feed his energy. Join the demon forces storming the building, and unleash Trigonic vortices to spread his power. <laughs> I'm a priest demon, and I'm Trigon. gonna eat all Some the rest might. of those suckers to the good stuff before Trigon lets them through. Steal some of the medicines from the
gives raising hell a new meaning. Speaking of, I'm hearing the other Titans are trying to save Raven from Trigon inside the Science Police HQ. Ready to clash with some Titans? Why has Trigon's full energy not come to this plane? That witch Raven must be resisting her father's commands. With the help of her allies, the Titans. Go, enter the station, defeat all you find inside, then invade Raven's soul to let Trigon triumph! Hey, we're in from Gotham, just trying to do a little business when the science police raided our operation. My boys... You go no further! I'll let the boss know. Take care of these cops for me, will you? is hard enough without you interfering. You've got to stop Run! Once merely a seeing stone, this treasure has been blessed by the touch of Trigon's wrath. Hey, face on meat fist! the way you came in. Thanks. We have a live one! Code 100, clear to engage. It'll save me a trip. Get ready for steel fists and white sound.
Requesting backup. Great. I'll head out the way you came in. Thanks. Requesting backup. Got to help. <gasps> Run for your life. I'll let the boss know. You've got to stop them. You're too late. She's resisting Trigon more every moment. Ah! I will resist you, and Father. I was worried I'd have to take the night off. No. You have no idea what you unleash upon this world. Raven's will is strong. Defeat her and let Trigon's energy loose in this plane. Trigon cannot be denied. So long as I live, I will defy you and my father. So long as I live, I will defy you and my father. So long as I live, I will defy you and my father. No! Trigon, you cannot be here. Daughter, Daughter, your, your power, power it wavers. wavers. Trigon's power is free. What have you done? Why must you force me to hate? once unremarkable, but these demonic scorch marks belie its otherwise simple appearance. Like a raven, I am an omen of darkness. Through me, Brother Blood has unleashed a dark and brutal evil onto this plane. I can no longer deny my fear that nothing, not even the Titans or our allies, can stop the demon Trigon from rising. He is an evil that has destroyed 10,000 worlds, and we are next, for the 
this monster Trigon is my father. It's like Raven will survive, but hey, Trigon's energy is free to utterly corrupt this plane. Yay for the home team. Look for a portal to make your escape, unless you want to be trapped in Raven's mind for eternity. Ugh. Let Raven escape. Trigon's evil permeates this plane right for our exploitation. Speak to Brother Blood in the safe house, for his ritual nears completion. Trigon must rise! With Trigon's energy unleashed, the sins will rise, and then Trigon himself. Brother Blood and Lord Trigon, thank you for your service. We will certainly call upon you at... Ah. I, the Monitor, am gathering the multiverse to face its greatest threat yet. We will need every ally we can get, even unexpected ones. Meet me aboard the House of Legends.